Um, hello everyone, my name is Li Hao. So our work is patch-based ComNet for host lab tissue image classification. Host lab tissue images are very high resolution uh, microscopic images of tissue sampled from patients, sometimes cancer patients. So given some cancer uh, tissue, we want to say what's the cancer subtype or grade of these uh, images or patients. So it's basically an image classification problem. And the uh, typical resolution of these images is like a 50K by 50K. So for size comparison, I put the image net image uh, in the corner. So you can say, because these uh, images are very large, you cannot run CNS directly. And uh, pathologists or doctors will examine you know, very high resolution patches. So maybe we can do a similar thing. We can run patch CNN on these uh, images. However, not all patches are discriminative. As you can see here, this is a grade 4 tumor. Some of the regions may be grade 2 or even healthy tissue. To address this, we proposed uh, a kind of method that uh, identifies discriminative patches automatically for patch-based CNN. And also, our method is general. We also apply it to other images. So if you have a similar problem like um, texture classification, you can talk with us. So this is our pipeline. We first train the CNN using our patches for several epochs. Then use the um, partially trained CNN. We identify discriminative patches robustly. I will skip the details here. But uh, after this, we can train the CNN using discriminative patches only. And this is done uh, in a EM fashion. And after several EM iterations, you will have a converged patch CNN. So during test time, you extract patches, uh, run the patch CNN through all of these patches. And now, how can you predict the label of the image? Voting or max pooling? Well, voting or max pooling assumes that one patch level class corresponds to one image level class, right? But in many cases, multiple patch level classes are correlated with one image level class. So to model this, we propose a supervised model such as uh, logistic regression or SVM that takes the histogram of patch level classes to predict the uh, image level class. Okay, so for the results, I will show you some of the results uh, on the Glioma dataset. Glioma is uh, one of the uh, leading causes of uh, cancer-related deaths, and it's the most common brain cancer. As you can see here, the patch-based scene with voting already outperformed the handcrafted uh, features. And our method achieved the state-of-the-art result. Additionally, uh, we searched online, and for the pathologist's agreement, we are kind of close. So uh, we achieved the state-of-the-art and close-to-human results. To conclude, we propose a patch-based CNN uh, for um, any kind of um, image classification if the discriminative information is in patch, is in patch scale. And uh, we achieve the state of art and close to human performance on uh, cancer subtype classification. Thank you.